We're starting a new topic today, and、um, you may well be able to guess what it is. But、um, I'm I'm not that interested if you guess what it is. I just want to、um, think about Usain Bolt for a little while. Does anyone know what the world record is that Usain Bolt holds for the 100 meter? Nine point. Pretty close. It's better than that. Nine point five eight seconds for a 100 meter dash. Does anyone know when he did it? 2000 and this year is the 10 year anniversary. So it's 2009, all the way back then. I actually wrote down. I think he got it in、um, Berlin. So 2009, as you guys know, that's not an Olympic year,、um, but this is the fastest time that he got, and they had all of the right like equipment to verify that this is the real time. So this is the record, right? 2009. However, I actually think. That the、uh, the race before this one, when he set a previous record, the one that this beat, I actually think it's much more interesting. It's nine point six nine seconds. Some of you, actually, how old were you guys? You were in primary school,、um, because this was the two thousand and eight Olympics. Does anyone remember where two thousand eight was? Were you old enough to remember? Uh, 2012 was London. Uh, 2008 was Beijing. Right. So. It's actually this one that interests me the most. Even though, strictly speaking, it's slower,、um, it's really interesting to me so much so that I want us to watch it together. Now, Selena, Selena, can you guys help me out with the blinds? And Mrs. Lee might get you to get the、uh, lights for me. Thank you very much. And、um, this is this is a few minutes, but I promise it's worth it. And I actually want you to watch really closely.、Um, Because there are a few details in this that we're going to call back to, so don't just watch it for entertainment. Though I actually want you to pay close attention. Okay, let's hope my、um, let's hope my speakers work. Here we go. I want to unpack this a little more, and I hope you did watch closely. There was a reason why I I clipped that much of the running, and so we could see the slow mo. You could hear what they were saying. Here's my initial question to you: How fast? How fast did Usain Bolt run? Like we don't usually think of、um, a speed in terms of just saying, "Oh, a time," right? This is actually a time, and it includes within it,、um, of course, a distance. And even even saying that, we don't usually focus on the time. We usually focus on how fast our units of speed are different units altogether. So I want to try and work out how we can actually take this and express it as something a little more familiar. So under here, maybe you want to jot down with me, right? This is stated in a bit of an unusual way: 9.69 seconds, and the distance that he ran was 100 meters. Right? Usually, I mean, if for example, and as you're going to see, this is probably the best comparison. If you were in a car, if you were in a car, how do you measure the speed of that car? At least in our country, <laughs> kilometers per kilometers per hour. Thank you. So we want a distance divided by a time kilometers. Per hour, so you'll need your calculator for this, by the way, because these are just weird numbers. Okay, so if we wrote down speed, we want a distance and then we want a time. Well, we have our distance here, right? It's 100 meters, and we have、um, Bolt's time, 9.69 seconds. So there. Is distance divided by time, but these are weird units. We don't think in meters, we don't think in seconds. Generally, we think in kilometers and hours. So, what can we do to this to make it a little bit easier to work with? Well, for starters, why are we counting in this kind of unit, 9.69 seconds? We can just divide 100 by 9.69, and、um, I think you've already got it, sorry. 10.31. 10. Point, give, give us a few more. 31991. Thank you. Okay. Dot, 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 dot. So this is the number of meters. Just in how many seconds? We divide by nine point six nine. So it's just in a single second. That's how far he goes, right? Which,、um, just intuitively, that should make sense because he did the one hundred meters in just under ten seconds. So that means every second he's going just a little bit more than ten meters. Following so far? Okay. Now、um, this is meters per second. Sorry, I'm missing the distance unit there. Uh, how do we turn this into something per hour? How would we work that out,、um, Gary? Yeah. Okay, so 
let's think about this for a second, right? I'm, I'm, I want to try and change as few things as, at a time as possible so we can get um, closer and closer. You've gone to 3.6, but before we get to that, let's just try and work out this time measurement, right? Seconds, how many seconds are there in an hour? How many seconds are there in an hour? There are 60 seconds in a minute, but then there are 60 of those in an hour. So it's 60 times 60, which is 3,600. So can we take this number? Can we multiply this, please, by 3,600? What do you get? 3,600. Yep. I'm guessing there's a 3 out the front. What are we getting? 3, 7. Say. Set. Can I get a few more? 151.702. Uh, okay, I'll stop there. So that's still meters, but now I'm not meters per second, am I? I've got 3,600 3, seconds, that's an hour. So this is meters per hour. And then I think to get to the last step, and this is why Gary said 3.6 rather than 3,600, he's immediately done the next step, which is to turn meters into kilometers. What do we do? Divide by 1,000. So that, we don't need our calculator for that. So that's 37, let's call that 37.15 kilometers per hour. So at least he wouldn't get booked in a school zone. This is how fast Usain Bolt ran at the 2008 Olympics. Now I'll let you, you, can, you could do the same kind of conversion for his actual record. And if you want to be really depressed, you can think about the fact that uh, he had to start from the blocks. They all had to start from the blocks, right? I had, I, this is not the main thing I'm interested in, but Usain Bolt actually has a faster record than this, even faster than 9.58. He has a record of 8.70, provided he has a running start. So there was like a 150 meter race um, somewhere else in 2009 that I can't remember, um, Manchester or something like that. So 150 meter race, he also set the record for it. But within that, the 100 meters, the last 100 meters, this is how fast he ran it, which is just insane, right?